job. Okay. Nice to meet you. you Thank too. you so much for coming out. Take care, okay? I'm crushed. You know, I'm bummed out. I'm disappointed. I'm lost. I'm definitely defeated. I came here to fall in love and, you know, show the grandkids how we met sort of thing. And I don't know when I'm going to find love. Oh, <laughs> well, you saw the heartbreaking farewell right here on Channel 7 Monday night. Rob Dom of Monroe was one of the contestants booted off from The Bachelorette this past week. He joined us during the 6 o'clock hour, and now he's with us again to talk about the show. All right, Rob, so first of all, when you see that clip, <laughs> are you still sad or? That poor guy. <laughs> <laughs> with that music underneath. It's just yeah. Like, yeah. yeah, honestly, though, that moment was uh, one of the toughest moments uh, I've had in a long time. You know, you, you, a lot goes into that, and you know, you just want to be liked. So um, it's wild watching it on TV, and my hands started sweating watching the roast ceremony. I knew how the roast ceremony ended, and it yeah. didn't change <laughs> watching it on TV. Talk about the application process. Bring us back to the very beginning. It all started right here in Novi. Yep, right here uh, up at the mall. I stood in line just like everybody else, and uh, it was it, it, you know a year in the, the whole uh, in the making. And you went into this thinking what? I mean, you'd only seen The Bachelor episode um, before, correct? Mm -hmm. Well, yeah. I, uh, once I started realizing that I might actually be on the show, then I really, I turned into like a super fan. Uh -huh. you know, reading all the, the forums and whatnot. But, you know, there was a couple of different phases. And each phase, it got a little bit more serious. And you're like, oh, I might actually go out there. <laughs> so <laughs> We were talking a little bit earlier off camera. Talk to us about some of the mind games they play with you. So you finally get selected. You go out there right before the show. And tell us about how long you're there in the hotel and all that. Well, yeah, I mean, you know, the, the goal is, you know, it's, a, it's an entertaining show. And uh, there's a lot of things that they do, you know, to just bring out the, the, the fun side of people. And uh, it was a little uh, crazy for me. But, um, I mean, you know, you're out there for a couple days before the show goes. And... Uh, you know, you, you're not allowed to communicate with anybody. They don't even let you leave the hotel room? Mm -mm. No, and you can watch that. There's a, there's a special on that. So you, you can see that whole process. And uh, it really amps up. When you, when you go there and, you know, you see everything for the, you know, firsthand, it really amps up that whole process. So the whole show is done. Obviously, we're watching it from the beginning. And when was this taped? Uh, that night I was out there, the night that you're watching was uh, March 15th. Okay. And tell us about meeting Ashley. So they throw you in the limo. Do you even know it's going to be her yet at that point? Yeah, yeah. You do? Okay. You, you just right before that. And, uh, you know, you get, you know, you're in the limo with, you know, three, four other guys. And, you know, you're all nervous, you know, and, uh, you know, idle chit chat. And then I wasn't the first guy with a limo. So I'm, I'm watching two guys, you know, do their little shtick. And uh, I'm like, I can do it better. I can do it better. <laughs> you know, it's, it's almost my turn. And, uh, you know, your heart's just pounding out of your chest. And uh, it, went out, it went out pretty well, but um, they edited it to make it a little nicer than, <laughs> than I <laughs> And once you get inside, what is that like? I mean, because you have, obviously, not very long to meet and kind of, what, get to know someone best you can in a few minutes. Yeah. Well, you, if you watch the show, what happens is, you know, I end up talking a lot about the mask. The yeah, guy with the, the mask. Yeah, the guy with the mask. What happened was I walked in before him. I didn't, he wasn't in my car. And he walks in, and I'm like, okay, okay, this is, this is <laughs> where we're a going. There's character, right? <laughs> yep. And so, yeah, so you're just, you know, you know, sizing everybody else up, trying to figure out what's going on, and uh, it, there's some chaos. It's pretty crazy. There was another contestant who was super drunk, according to the footage we saw. Is that any of that planned stage, or that's just natural? Uh, you know, when I, when I was skeptical, you know, going into it, but it, I can honestly test that it's more real than, than I thought it was. You know, I don't, I don't have any reason to say otherwise, and it's just fascinating. Fascinating to see all this actually happening in front of you. It was uh, almost surreal. And what's going on with you now? You're, uh, you're, you're still single, correct? That I am. And what has the show done for you? I mean, you've had millions of people um, watch you. Yes, uh, it's been um, honestly amazing. You know, I, I went on there. I wasn't like the drunk guy, or you know, I walked out with my dignity. And uh, I think that a lot of people reached out to me to make sure that I'd be okay. So. The, from the lowest low of, you know, not getting a rose and saying my farewells, uh, that was balanced out by the response from the people watching. Including some marriage proposals we hear. Yeah. <laughs> Very nice. You're doing well for yourself. Yeah. Real quick, you own a computer technology business in Monroe. Is that your future? Are you going to stick with that or do some other things? Uh, well, you know, this has obviously opened up some opportunities in, in, uh, on TV and on the screen, so that's been amazing. But, yes, my computer company has been, uh, I've had it since I was 16, and it slowly continues to grow, so keep everything going. All right, Wonderful. Rob, thanks so much. Good we'll luck be, to we'll you. We'll be watching very closely. Thanks Thank for your time you, this Rob. morning. We appreciate it. It was fun. One Action News.